Hey y'all, how's it going? Welcome back to another exciting episode of what now? No, griddle porn. Uh, we're gonna attempt chili. I've done it once before and it turned out really good. So we're trying it again. And uh, we'll start off with Oh, let's try some vegetable oil. What do you say? La da da. Veggie oil. Veggie oil. Of course, one of the most popular questions is what type of oil to use to griddle and to clean and to um, season. I use vegetable oil sometimes I use other like avocado oil or my homemade ghee that I'm very proud of but every day just vegetable oil it's cheap and it does it's got a high uh, smoke point so it does a good job for the money the seasoning just the same thing went with uh, vegetable oil so going with the holy trinity onions bell peppers bell peppers and celery these are frozen because that's what i have before you say why don't you use fresh because i have frozen and i'm using them that's why huh. i just tried to Help himself to food. Nasty spider. As, as with most things, it's turned down to medium, medium low. We'll let these go a minute. Maybe two minutes. Just for kicks. Don't need time. Uh, let's see, what else do we have here? We discussed the supper. Got some fresh tomato I chopped up that was, uh, I was gonna use some canned stuff, but it was starting to go bad. I was gonna use it in uh, grilled cheese. So, I wanted to use it before it did go bad. So you'll be seeing an appearance from live tomatoes. That's going good. At some point I'll start adding some seasonings. But not quite yet. Not yet, not yet. I had my Rubbermaid box. I don't know if you can see this. Uh, probably not. But... too small so I got a Homer box toolbox and uh, it's working well so far. Easier to carry than a handleless Rubbermaid box. Da, 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 da. The onion will quit, cook quick. I could have held it off and just done the celery first, but I didn't want to. But celery does take longer. Da, da, da. And the frozen pepper does whatever frozen pepper wants to do. That's just the way it is. Yeah, we could throw on some my homemade Salt, pepper, garlic, other stuff. Could even dump on some Mrs. Dash. Never go wrong with Mrs. Dash. And I forgot my garlic again. How could you let me forget my garlic? Okay, we're going to pause for just a moment. 
while I go find my garlic and we'll be right back and welcome back I'd like to thank today's sponsors the Refrigerator Garlic Association and the Romanian Chickpea Group Oh no, does that sound weird? Let's go with it anyway. I stand by my statement. How's that looking? Oh, doesn't it smell good? I love my veggies on the griddle. Let's uh, slide all this to one side, shall we? We can still flatten the curve with it as we try really hard. Okay, what else should we add? Maybe some, yeah, let's go with oil again. Maybe some veggie oil. Da -da. Veggie, 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 veggie. So, I have a leftover sirloin that I chopped up. Just uh, give it a boost of flavor, make it chewy, crunchy, or something, I don't know. But wait, there's more! We've got some Angus Ground Chuck 80-20 that we got on sale at the, uh, the market. A really good market price. And you can't have chili without some ground chuck. Poor chuck! So, oh. get that chopped up here. And as it cooks, it'll continue to break up. But wait, there's more! Trader Joe's ground pork. Because we can. Just have an opening. <laughs> anyway, I love ground pork and ground beef mixed in my in my chili. Oh, oh, get back here. Man down, man down. <laughs> oh, the pink is really smelling good. May eat that right off the griddle. May not make it to the chili. Oh, hi, Fred. Baja's got a friend visiting. Fred who thinks griddling is the bestest thing ever, right Fred? You're not getting any chili though, sorry dude. <laughs> so while it's cooking, let's throw in the magic spices and seasonings and herbs. I'm kind of addicted to my own seasoning. Is that okay? Is that... Can't be wrong when it feels so right, right Fred? What Baja? Baja wants to chase the ball and Fred wants to chase... Baja. Uh, this is... 
I threw on some more Mrs. Dash and some chopped chives. I really like the chopped chives. And uh, what else could we throw on here? Maybe a little chili lime just to keep it honest. And here, Raja. I think Raja the cat may be visiting too. <laughs> hey, Fred. We may find a Scooby snack for you, but no chili. Sorry. Sorry, Freddy. So we got that going. I'm going well, I think. Maybe, hopefully. Ahead and move the camera. Hopefully you're still there, still on things. Let's see, right, Fred? Oh, yeah. What a puppy. He's a cute little chihuahua mix. <laughs> well, excuse me. What do you mean by that? You don't like being called a chihuahua mix? What would you like to be called? Just Fred? Right said Fred? Are you too sexy for your coat? Too sexy for your tail? Huh? Yeah, yeah, there's your boy. <laughs> What now you're here? Because you're looking for chili and you're not getting it. No chili for you. Okay, this is almost cooked. I want to make sure the meat's completely done before I mix it. Actually, yeah, don't want to take any chances. So, what else do we have, you ask? The tomatoes that I mentioned, that I threatened you with. You want to smell the tomatoes? You don't trust me with tomatoes? Fred does not trust my tomatoes. What? Right now I'm leaving it on the tomatoes on top of the other veggies. So they're kind of getting some steam action going there. So good. Right? Fred's hunting just in case. I drop a piece of something. Oh, you like carrots though, don't you? Fred likes carrots. I don't know if that's a... I've known chihuahuas. I've never known one to like carrots, so it's not a chihuahua thing. Of course, you know, Santa Barbara, everyone's a vegan here. Not that there's anything wrong with that. In fact, I've had some very delicious vegan dishes and actually made a few. On the griddle. Okay, that's getting close to done. So let's mix it together. Make some, make some music. Make some noise. Meat needs to cook a little bit more. That's okay, because we're not done yet. Last time, it was pretty much like this, a lot like this, and I went bean-like. But going out a on a limb and trying chili beans. I don't know how it'll work. 
I don't know if they'll even come out of the can. Oh yeah, they're coming out. Want some beans? You're a weird dog. You're so weird. Okay. Let's mix in the chili beans. Mix in the tomatoes. Make sure the meat's getting cooked. How's it looking, huh? Is it looking good? Well, huh? What do you think? So it's looking kind of goulashy. Wow. Found a hot spot over here. Got them turned down to about the same temperature, but okay. Can't be chilly without some chili seasoning. I'm gonna use like half a pack, maybe. Not even that. I'm just sprinkling on some random amounts of chili seasoning. Right, Fred? No, you can't have chili. Chili dog. Chili dog. Right, Baja? Ooh, now it smells like chili. Should we give something a random taste just to see if I need to add or subtract anything? Kind of late if I subtract it to subtract. Get a piece of meat. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Maybe. It's not bad. Let it cook a little bit more. I can get it all together. Nice and yummy. Meanwhile, can you see Fred? Let's see Fred. There's Fred, hey Fred. There's Baja waiting for the ball. And there's a griddle full of chili. What? Yes, you're a star. Sorry I had to leave you alone for a sec because he looked so beautiful, so I got some treats. We just happened to keep some treats for dogs that aren't ours. And she rolled her ball. Good catch. Of course. I also pet sit and make friends with dogs. So both myself and my lovely assistant volunteer at the shelter. So we're always around animals. Of course she's around me, which means she's always around an animal. <laughs> right, Fred? I am too sexy for my griddle. Too sexy for my griddle. This is uh, looking and smelling really good. You know what I think it's time for, Fred? I think it may be time for 
an extreme close up. Don't want to, I just repaired my overpriced camera stand and I don't trust it enough to do this. Ah, 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 extreme close up. I didn't trust the stand enough to do that to, without you falling off. So, how does it look? In smell o vision. That is today's chili on the griddle. So, hopefully, it'll taste good. And, uh,. Fred, what do you think? Do you have anything to add? No. How about you, Baja? Just throw the ball. Okay, thanks for watching, y'all. And that's a wrap.